They've both got three each. Oh, what a catch! Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the second test match of two, everyone, where New Zealand's going to be taking on the West Indies in the second test, as I've already said, in Wellington. We've got Tom Latham, the captain for this game, because... Kane Williamson sits out, and Joshua De Silva and Chamar Holder are making their test taboos. We're going to get straight into it, guys. Tom Latham's going to call heads, and we've lost the toss and been put into bat, which is exactly what happened in real life. So this should be a very good contest, guys. We're actually going to turn fours on for today for when we bat, and we're just going to get straight into it as Blundell is going to glance this one away for four runs to get the account underway. On the first morning of the first test, or not really, the first morning of the second test of day one. And Blundell's going to cut that one nicely for four. 16 without loss. Oh, no. But Latham's gone. He nicks off to hold up for just five runs, exposing Will Young early in the test match. 19 for one New Zealand. That's a great shot from Blundell. Wow, he timed that one nicely. Young, uh, it's going to be facing a bit of a test here. Joseph coming around the wicket. And now he's come back over. Blundell in the gap again for more. 33 for one. Oh, that's a good shot from Blundell. That, he's strong there. Don't bowl there, boys. Do not bowl short to Blundell. He is doing quite nicely here on the morning session, but he's gone. Just when he got himself in, too. He nicks off for 28. 42 for two. And New Zealand, a little bit of a shaky start here. 45 for two. Look at this field to Ross Taylor. Gee, anyway, that's lunch on day one. 52 for two. It's been quite a battling session. Will Young, 11 of 58. Really battling his way through there. But that's a good shot. That's four. Moves to 19 now. Off about 80-odd balls. And now he's going to get another one. Another boundary. But he's edged off and caught at first slip. He's gone for 24, 69 for three, New Zealand. Really struggling here on day one. Ross Taylor's going to get a boundary. I think we just need to slow down a bit. Oh, that's a good shot. Four runs. Because, gee, we're, we're just struggling just a little bit. We've just got to get a partnership together. That's a good shot from Taylor. Straight back where it came from. Four runs. And that's T on day one. A good little partnership just starting to build here. But the clouds have rolled in. And that's a swing and a miss. Thank goodness. The, the clouds have rolled in. But Taylor. Oh, he smoked that. What a shot that is. Nichols nearly gets bowled. But it was a noble anyway. That's cool. Taylor, he's going to edge it, and they're off for a single to bring up his 50. Good stuff by Ross Taylor. 139 for three. That's four runs for Nichols. Another four runs for Nichols. Moves to 32. The partnership building nicely now. But Taylor goes as soon as I say that. Of course, he goes at a wide one, edges off. That's a great catch from De Silva. And he goes for 53, meaning New Zealand are back under the pump again. 163 for four, and Watling's been bowled for just three off nine. And Mitchell hits a four, good shot there. 171 for five. Oh, it's a tight single, I tell you what. Nichols is gone for 43 off 129. He takes a tight one on and can't make it. Four buyers will take them all. Thank you. West Indies have taken the new ball. 183 for six. Jameson has edged off for just three. And gee, New Zealand are in huge trouble here. Big, big trouble. Not even 200 on the board. And Sally's edged off for four now as well. That's the end of day one as well. Mitchell on strike. And straight away... Edges away for four runs. He's going to have to get going here because he's batting with Wagner and Bolt. And Wagner's <laughs> pitch cut it away for four. Oh, that's an interesting shot, I tell you what. That's a shot. 
four. Daryl Mitchell's going to have to keep most of the strike, you'd think, here. Oh, that's a shot and a half. That's four. Chase into the attack now. 219 for eight. Oh, my goodness. He smoked that, Mitchell. Get out of here. 223 for eight. Can New Zealand just keep rollicking along and see where we get to? Maybe 230. We're up to 230 now. Wagner just starting to free up a little bit. That's a good shot. Four runs for Wagner. 240 now. Got one ball to face. That's down the leg. And they survive wicketless to the lunch interval on day two. Mitchell closing in on a 50. And gets it with that shot. Brings up 50. And he's got another four now. He can start just moving along a little bit here. And Wagner puts a full toss away for four. Gee, tell you what. 264 for eight. Oh, that's a good ball. That's a good ball. 266. Mitchell cuts now. Four. 271. Who would have seen this coming? Now Mitchell hits another four. Chase. What can he do now? He's going to get him. <laughs> that's what he's going to do. He's going to get Mitchell playing all around it. Gone. And Trent Bolt is going to walk to the crease. Can he survive this one and get Wagner on strike? That's the real question. Wow, what can I say? He's smashed a four. There you go. The last wicket stand here. Anything can happen. They've survived till T. 299 for nine. New Zealand still batting away, leading the pitch deteriorate. And Bolt's nicked off with a great catch from De Silva. 299 all out. A good batting innings there, I tell you what. Mitchell getting 70. And good support from the tail enders as well. We're going to go full on aggressive because why not? We're going to get rid of the boundaries because we are bowling now. All right. Just going to see Bolt to Brathwaite. Gone through him. Swung it back. Didn't see that one. Gone. Bolt strikes early in the second innings here. Campbell's doing nicely. We're going to bring on Jameson. Just going to bring it back a touch. Uh, Bolt has basically bowled himself out here. We've well and truly got in here. We've got to be a bit defensive here. As Campbell brings up a 50. Two overs to go. Dow Mitchell is going to come on for a sneaky over, but he gets pummeled. Bolt with the last and nothing. End of day two. 98 for one, the West Indies. What a start it has been for them. Well, we've got to attack them in the morning, you'd think, because they're not quite settled. So we're going to go with Saudi and Bolt to start. Bolt to Campbell. Oh, swings and misses. Saudi to Campbell. Edged and taken. That's why you attack in the morning. They're not quite settled. Just couldn't get going this morning, and he's gone. Beautiful bowling there by Tim Southey. And great support by Trent Bolt. Edged and gone again. Taylor with the catch. Taylor's got two catches now. Southey to Bravo. He's the key wicket, but that is outside the line. Okay, now they're getting a little bit too far into their spells here. Keep attacking with Chase. Just drop a little bit with Bravo, you'd think. And Wagner. Okay, nothing really happening here. Bravo gets 50. Jameson to Bravo. Cleans him up. That came back. And he goes for 57. That's a big wicket. New Zealand lead by 145 now. Wagner with Jameson. Gets Chase with a beauty. What a Yorker that is. Look at this again. Well, actually went through his pad, but... You know, you take them all. Uh, Jameson is really struggling big time here. Mitchell's going to come in for a quick spell. And gets nothing, which is fair. Lunch on day three. We lead by 122. Come on, Jameson. I back you, son. Oh, Blackwood's having a bit of a crack. Got to go a bit defensive to him, I think. You just got to let him do his thing and let him get himself out. I could be wrong in saying that. These two are batting nicely, though. 
Okay, Bolt's gonna come back to Blackwood. And gone! He gets himself out all right. He's hit it straight to slip, and he's gone. We nicked it. I guess straight to slip, and he's gone. Big wicket. Bolt and Saudi will come back for another spell. Uh, it's outside the line, unfortunately. Gone! Holder goes for 33. The door is open for New Zealand to crack the rest of the tail here. Oh my goodness, Saudi's getting it to swing back. They've both got three each. Oh, what a catch! No way! Screamer! He's absolutely nailed it. Don't know who it is. Salvi! Look at this again. Oh my goodness. I think that's the one hand as well. Salvi to Gabriel. Oh, nearly gets him. 259 for 9. Oh, it's out of the line. Okay, don't expect too much too soon. Whoa. What am I saying? That's a beauty. And Bolt gets Holder for a four ball duck. Beaten by pace. New Zealand lead by 40 in the second innings. And Bolt takes a 5 for. Well done, Trent Bolt. 5 for, tw uh, five for 71. And New Zealand are going to be batting again. With Latham cleaned up. For a symbol duck. Oh dear. Oh, shot from Will Young. That's four. T on day three. We're basically 48 for one here. Make that two. Gabriel gets Young. That is not great news for us. That's a good shot from Ross Taylor. He's in good form in this match, but he's going to have to do a lot of work for us here. That's four more. 68 for two in theory. Oh my lord, he's opened that up. He smoked that out the ground. See you later, boys. But he's the key wicket and he's gone. He's gone playing across the line. That's plum middle stump. That is a big wicket. Oh dear, 43 for 3. New Zealand in all sorts of trouble. That's a good shot from Blundell, I tell you what. 4. Oh, that's a good shot from Nichols. Hooking it from his face, basically. That's four runs. We're going to need a lot of good work from these two. That's a six. Okay. Blundell's just cut that one away. Hard, fast hands for six. But he's inside edged, and it's a great catch. Gone for 21, and New Zealand a 99 for four. What is going on? Look at this field. Everyone's around the bat. Oh, and he's edged it straight. Yeah, tell you what, that is lucky, that. That is very, very lucky. We're going to need to fight hard here, New Zealand. What? <laughs> We're going to need to fight hard. BJ Watling slogs one down the ground just over the field for four. All right. That's a four, though. That's a good shot. That's the end of the day. 128. And I'll tell you what, the pitch is still not deteriorating that much. Oh, streaky from Nichols, but he gets four to start his day off. We just gonna make sure we settle down for the day here. One seventeen for four. Yeah, good shot from Nichols. That's four. One twenty-three for four. So about a hundred and sixty odd lead. That's four. That's a good shot. Watling. Oh, bangs that one away for six. What a shot. All right. 135. So that's a 175-ish lead. That's four from Nichols. What a shot. That'll be another four. Mm, gee, okay. He's picking the same gap here. What's he going to do this time? Oh, he goes in that gap. Four more. Brings up a 52. Well played, Henry Nichols. Oh no, Watling's gone though. For 36, and it's Mitchell and Nichols. We're going to have to stitch together a partnership. Well, that's a great shot from Mitchell though. He top scored in the first innings. What has he got in the second? That's four buys. We'll take them all. 200 is the lead now. Not ungettable though. Especially because we're 171 for five. That's a good shot from Nichols in the gap four. Oh, but he's gone, though. LBW on the stroke with lunch. Would you believe it? Is this going down or hitting? It looked like maybe with the angle it's going down. But in the end, it looks like it is hitting. Leg stump just 
Yep, hidden leak stump. That's all she wrote. Jameson has got a boundary. Nice. What a shot. Ooh, nearly edges off, though. Okay, uh, Mitchell can bat nicely with Jameson for now. Because he can trust his average just a little bit. That's a good shot. That's four. 202. So about 242 is the lead. And Mitchell is bold. That is big. That is not really good news for us at all. Because now we've got no recognized batters left. All bowlers. To flesh out the rest of this lead here. And if it's spinning, which it's not, then it's uh, bad news for our team because we've got no spinners. And that's another great catch from De Silva. Southie goes for five. Wendy's are taking the new ball. Oh, Jameson swings and misses. 250's the lead. But Jameson nicks this one. Gone. Bolt. Swings and misses. Oh, that's a shot from Bolt. He's going to get four. But edges straight to slip, gone. 255 is the lead. 256 for the Windies to win the second test match. Would you believe it? Okay. Here we go. A challenge is on the board. We're going to need early wickets, that's for sure. Sally to Brathwaite. That's a swing and a miss. Bolt to Campbell. Oh, it's a beauty, but they go to T unscathed. 235 remaining. Time is not a factor, really, in this test too much. I have to go a little bit more defensive now. Bolt to Brathwaite. Oh, he's edged to four, though. That's not great news at all. Wagner into the attack to Campbell. Oh, where's the short leg? 189. Oh, dear. 172. They're definitely getting away here very, very quickly. 94 without loss. Oh, Campbell's got hit hard, though. By Wagner. And is okay. Damn. Well, that's a shame for our team, I guess, but that's all right. Oh, plays and misses. Trent Bolt's been the pick of the bowlers for us this test match, but it's not going his way right now. 140 to win. <laughs> Jeez, this is going terribly for us. Bolt gets Brathwaite, though. Is there an opening there? I don't know. We'll have to find out pretty quick because there isn't much time left in the day. And it's the end of the day. They need 118 with nine wickets in the bag. Can New Zealand pull off a miracle? We'll have to wait and see. But it looks like at the moment the Windies are well and truly going to win this match. But Campbell is bowl for 86. Is there a twist yet in this tale? 99 to win, 8 wickets in hand. It is hooping all over the place. Oh, he gets Brooks around the wicket. I don't know what's he, what he's even doing around the wicket. Anyway, he's got Brooks. Chase to the crease, and he's gone for a second ball duck. 97 to win. Now just 6 wickets in hand. Bravo got away a little bit there. Now he's on 32. Okay, Wagner's going to have a bowl. I don't want to put Jameson on for too long. That's the real problem. 46. Oh, dear. Yeah, they've, they've really and truly got this, I think, back in the game. Unless we take a wicket now, it's curtains for us. Can we take one is the real question. We're just going to have to... Hmm. kind of feel like we have to still go attacking. Otherwise, the game's going to be over. Oh, just short. 29 to win. Well, Bolt. Have you got something for us, son? Saudi? 15. No, that'll be the game, I think. Oh, Blackwood goes. I just don't see it happening, though. Yeah, 6 to win. 3 to win. That's lunch on day 5. Bolt to hold up. And thumps the winning runs, and the Windies have won by five wickets. Would you believe it? Again, the Windies just tie the series one all. We are pretty average then, aren't we, at this game? 
Man of the match goes to Campbell with 70 and 86. And the Windies win by five wickets. Bolt goes from taking five for 71 to two for 100. Yeah, not great. Not going to win too many tests when you're getting that return in the second dig. Yeah, you just kind of feel like our batting let us down just a little bit. Especially because Wendy's got 258 for 5 and we've got 215 all out. Oh dear. Especially in the first innings as well. A lot of starts, but a lot of outs. Wagner dug in. And with the ball, we just, I think, missed Kyle Jamison big time, I think, across the whole game. One for 69 there, and none for 43 for Jamison. So he was a massive loss for us in that game. It says the Windies win the series 1-0, but it is tied at one apiece. And that is the series done and dusted, guys. If you did enjoy this episode, guys, make sure, please, that you leave a like. Subscribe for more content such as this, guys. Don't forget to follow me on my social medias down below, especially on Twitter. I post there a lot, and I will see you all in the next episode, guys. Don't forget to join on the Discord server as well. The link will be down in the description below. Otherwise, I will see you all in the next episode, guys. Good. Bye for now.